वेलकम गाइस इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल ऑफ विजुअल स्टूडियो 2019 विद सी शार्प आई विल शो यू हाउ टू डाउनलोड एंड इंस्टॉल माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एसक्यूएल सर्वर 2019 अगर आपने मेरे इस चैनल को अभी तक सब्सक्राइब नहीं किया है तो प्लीज इसको अभी सब्सक्राइब करें सब्सक्राइब करने के लिए मेरे इस वीडियो के नीचे इस सब्सक्राइब बटन पर क्लिक करें और साथ ही साथ वीडियो को लाइक करना ना भूलें so first of all write on google download microsoft sql server 2019 and click on the second option available on google chrome that is sql server downloads it is a product of microsoft and it will open the official site of microsoft i will write the url of this website in the description of this video here you will find two options sql server 2019 on premises and sql server 2019 on azure then scroll it down and you will find two more options to download a free specialized edition that is a developer edition and a express edition click on this express edition and download a file after downloading it you will see this type of file which is sql 2019 ssei express edition exe file double click on this exe file and execute it on your computer this type of screen will occur on your computer which shows you three option basic custom and download media now click on custom option after clicking on it you will see it will ask you the media location where you want to install this file so you can browse it from here and give it a location where you want to install this click on install button and this software started to install on your machine it will take time it will depend on your internet speed because it have to download 800 mb approx data then wait for some time it is downloading and after the completion of downloading this type of screen will appear on your computer then click on new sql server stand alone installation add feature to an existing allocation then this type of screen will appear click on i accept license and terms and click on next button it will download and run all the global rules from internet after completion of downloading click on next button and then it will show you an option of microsoft update check here if you want to use microsoft update to check for updates recommended as of now i am not checking this checkbox and click on next button so here you will see this type of window will occur and here is a warning message window firewall a warning message displaying here so just avoid it and click on next button so here is the main feature feature selection in feature selection option click on the database engine service which is the first option here and scroll it down after is cloning you have to check client tool connectivity client tool backward compatibility client tool sdk sql client connectivity sdk after checking all these options click on next button here you have to choose named instance and you can give the name here i am giving sql express name you can provide the name here as of your choice after that click on next button and 
this type of screen will appear which shows server configuration. Click on next button. And here you have to choose a mixed mode of server configuration which specify you the password for the SQL Server System Administrator SA. SA is the by default username of your account and you have to give a password here of your choice and then re-enter the password to confirm it. After that click on next button. So the installation process is start here and you have to wait for a few seconds or a minutes and then click on next button. After clicking on next button you will see Microsoft SQL Server 2019 successfully installed on your machine. Then close the window. Again the same window which occur on your screen earlier again occur on your screen and now click on install SQL Server management tool because now you have to download the SQL Server management tool for the smooth functioning of Microsoft SQL Server 2019. After clicking here, this type of web page will appear on your web browser. Again, I will write the URL of this website in the comment box or a description of my video. So, you can see that download SQL Server Management Studio SSMS link here. Just scroll it down and you will find download SSMS link. Click here to download MS SQL Server Management Studio and you will find another exe file which shows SSMS setup and you have to double click on this exe file as well. So it will ask you to install it on your machine then click on install button and wait for a few minutes because it also download and install few package and few libraries. After completion the downloading just close the window. So Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio is also ready on your machine after executing all the two files which I have shown you earlier. Now I will tell you how to configure the Microsoft SQL Server 2019 on your machine. So just type on your search option SQL and click on Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio. Again wait for some time to open it. Click on connect button here. Here you are having three options server type which is database engine. I am showing you few options but you have to choose database engine first. Server name the name which you have given during installation authentication you have to choose window authentication here first click on connect button so now it is connected to your machine here click on property right click on this desktop name of your computer click on property then so here you will find few options like first one is general option just avoid it second one is memory option so here the system is showing you minimum server memory in MB and the maximum server memory in MB so you can adjust this memory as per your computer's memory available and or click on processors 
here you will find few options but no need to change them then click on security here also you are not required to change anything then click on connection here just click on here in this checkbox which is allow remote connection to the server and then click on database setting here in database setting option you have to choose a backup checksum here which is a most important feature so don't forget to click here on a backup checksum click on advanced setting here in advanced setting the option is parallelism type cost threshold for parallelism by default option is five year but you have to change it for smooth functioning and max degree of parallelism i have typed two here because i am using the core 2 due processor it will depend on your computer machine if you are using core 4 then type 4 here and if you are using core 2 then type 2 here then permissions no need to change here as well and after updating all these information just click on ok button and now your microsoft sql server 2019 is ready to use so in our next tutorial i will show you how to create an application which is connected to this database so hope this video will clear you how to install and configure the Microsoft SQL Server. Thanks for watching my video.